for ios listening mcq you should keep in mind something one is scanning kosher and option duty scanning kora chesta korte hobe shombhob na hole question bhalo bhabe porte hobe ekhane apnader subidhar jonno ekti question dewa holo tar moddhe ekti question ami bolchi dekhun ekhane as a family welcome event in the art gallery begins arthat ekhane kokhon shuru hobe etai mone rakhte hobe second thing is avoid trap sadharonto shobgulo option niye kotha bola hoy tobe incorrect option gulo negative word byabohar kore bole othoba disagree kore ba something like that ekhane apnara ekti audio shoho niye dewa ache ti dekhun tahole i bujhte parben now listen carefully and answer questions 11 to 16. Hi, great to see you. I'm Jody, and I'll be looking after both of you for the first month you're working here at the Amersham Theatre. I'll tell you something about the theatre now, then take you to meet two of the other staff. It's an old building, and it's been modernised several times. In fact, as you can see, we're carrying out a major refurbishment at the moment. The interior has just been repainted, and we're about to start on the exterior of the building. That'll be a big job. The work's running over budget, so we've had to postpone installing an elevator. I hope you're happy running up and down stairs. When the theatre was built, people were generally slimmer and shorter than now, and the seats were very close together. We've replaced them with larger seats, with more legroom. This means fewer seats in total, but we've taken the opportunity to install seats that can easily be moved to create different acting spaces. We've also turned a few storerooms over to other purposes, like using them for meetings. We try hard to involve members of the public in the theatre. One way is by organising backstage tours, so people can be shown round the building and learn how a theatre operates. These are proving very popular. What we're finding is that people want to have lunch or a cup of coffee while they're here, so we're looking into the possibility of opening a cafe in due course. We have a bookshop which specialises in books about drama and that attracts plenty of customers. Then there are two large rooms that will be decorated next month, and they'll be available for hire, for conferences and private functions, such as parties. We're also considering hiring out costumes to amateur drama clubs. Now I want to tell you about our workshops. We recently started a programme of workshops that anyone can join. Eventually, we intend to run courses in acting, but we're waiting until we've got the right people in place as trainers. That's proving more difficult than we'd expected. There's a big demand to learn about the technical side of putting on a production, and our lighting workshop has already started with great success. We're going to start one on sound next month. A number of people have inquired about workshops on makeup, and that's something we're considering for the future. A surprise success is the workshop on making puppets. We happen to have someone working here who does it as a hobby, and she offered to run a workshop. It was so popular, we're now running them every month. And third important thing is eliminate option. Ekhane option eliminate kora chesta korte hobe karon ekti option eliminate korte parle apnar chance 50% bere jabe. You will see that there is an example that has been done for you. On this occasion only, the conversation relating to this will be played first. Good morning, this is Burnham Tourist Office, Martin speaking. Oh, hello. I saw a poster about free things to do in the area, and it said people should phone you for information. I'm coming to Burnham with my husband and two children for a few days on June the 27th or possibly the 28th. 
and I'd like some ideas for things to do on the twenty ninth. Yes, of course. The date that the woman wants information about is the twenty ninth of June, so the letter C has been circled. Now we shall begin. You should answer the questions as you listen, because you will not hear the recording a second time. Listen carefully, and answer questions one to six. Good morning. This is Burnham Tourist Office. Martin speaking. Oh, hello. I saw a poster about free things to do in the area, and it said people should phone you for information. I'm coming to Burnham with my husband and two children for a few days on June the twenty seventh, or possibly the twenty eighth, and I'd like some ideas for things to do on the twenty ninth. Yes, of course. Okay. Then let's start with a couple of events, especially for children. The art gallery is holding an event called Family Welcome that day, when there are activities and trails to use throughout the gallery. That sounds interesting. What time does it start? The gallery opens at ten, and the family welcome event runs from ten thirty until two o'clock. The gallery stays open until five, and several times during the day they're going to show a short film that the gallery has produced. It demonstrates how ceramics are made, and there'll be equipment and materials for children to have a go themselves. Last time they ran the event, there was a film about painting, which went down very well with the children, and they're now working on one about sculpture. I like the sound of that. And what other events happen in Burnham? Well, do you all enjoy listening to music? Oh yes. Well, there are several free concerts taking place at different times: one or two in the morning, the majority at lunchtime, and a couple in the evening. And they range from pop music to Latin American. The Latin American could be fun. What time is that? It's being repeated several times in different places. They're performing in the Central Library at one o'clock. Then at four, it's in the City Museum. And in the evening at seven thirty, there's a longer concert in the theatre. Right, I'll suggest that to the rest of the family. Something else you might be interested in is the boat race along the river. Oh yes, do tell me about that. The race starts at Offord Marina to the north of Burnham and goes as far as Summer Pool. The best place to watch it from is Charlesworth Bridge, though that does get rather crowded. And who's taking part? Well, local boat clubs, but the standard is very high. One of them came first in the West of England Regional Championship in May this year. It was the first time a team from Burnham has won. It means that next year they'll be representing the region in the national championship.